Just learning that the National Guard will start pulling out of Los Angeles immediately. Thousands of Guard members were sent here a week ago to ease some of last weekend's unrest. NBC4's Darsha Phillips joining us live now in downtown LA with more on that. Darsha. Well, Jonathan, we did see some Humvees rolling out of downtown Los Angeles about an hour ago. The L.A. Convention Center, where the National Guard was staging, pretty much empty right now. But here's what it looked like earlier as guards been prepared to make their departure from our area. For the past week, the National Guard used the L.A. Convention Center as its staging area, assisting local law enforcement. In the days after George Floyd's death and the protests that followed, military trucks were also seen leaving their post at City Hall in downtown Los Angeles earlier. Earlier today. Now, the National Guard has been a visible and controversial presence here in Los Angeles. We all will likely forever remember these images of service members in fatigues, some carrying M4 rifles, standing guard around places like the Beverly Center, Santa Monica Place, Los Angeles City Hall, and other landmarks. Governor Gavin Newsom deployed 7,000 service members across the state, and at one point in the past week, more than 1,000 guardsmen were mobilized right here in the LA area. We haven't seen a presence like that. In the LA area since 1994 after the Northridge earthquake. Now, back here live, it does look like most of the National Guardsmen have left the LA uh, Convention Center, but we are told by Mayor Eric Garcetti that a small unit will remain nearby in case of an emergency. That's the latest from downtown Los Angeles. I'm Darsha Phillips. We'll send it back to you guys.